What's up, YouTubers? This is Tim Yu-Gi-Oh! 2 here. Today I'm here with Mike Murphy. Uh, we ran a non-tier deck tournament uh, just to have a bit of a break from the current meta and to see what decks people would come up with. And the winning deck was uh, Mike's deck, and this is his Skull Servant deck profile. Right, as you can see, reading the Skull Servant, he's boss. Like, he just, he's so good, like. For each Skull Servant in the graveyard, he gains a thousand attack. And you've got your free white mare. Uh, you can discard him to special summon a banished lady of the white, or you can discard him to add a school servant from the banished zone to the graveyard. Three lady in white. Basically, the idea is to get its name is also treated as school servant in the graveyard, so it gives school servant a boost. Um, but the idea is to get these two out on the board. You get this in defense mode, and this it's, it makes king of the school servants unaffected by spells and traps. Pretty good. And then you've got your two white prints and your two school servants. I play, I don't play three of each because it's cloggy. And like, you can't play one, you can't play three of each and then two of the other one because it, it, again, it just, they both fight each other. Uh, map petition, this card is amazing. Like today it was so good. You just go, someone send white prints and then white prints sends a lady in white and a school servant, which then puts three monsters in the graveyard theoretically. Um, I don't run Dark Arm Dragon because um, of the fact is I just don't wanna, like if you open it with Map Petition, it's good, but it just, if you don't, if you draw it late game, kinda, just kinda, kinda suck. Your team Mizuki, only two, not three, because again, clogginess, and just, it's special summons. Two Zombie Master, again, summons um, King of School Servant, and just a general monster. That's the monsters. Three mystical space typhoon because this deck doesn't like back row, it doesn't like traps. So three pot of duality because you don't always special summon, you want to get to your cards faster, you want to get to your map petition. The two fiendish chain, I was tempted to run three, but I'm playing another card over it, which I'll show you in a minute. Just because we don't like effects. The one pulse. The one TT and the one mirror force. I run this over the fiendish chain because um, of the just because it's non-tier. Uh, two book of life. Special summons one back. Really good. One for one summons king of school servants, which is good. Burial. Foolish. And soul charge. Regeki. And warning. Let's go. Cool. And on to your extra deck. I didn't really have time to think about the extra deck very much. I just banged in whatever I could because, like, because this weekend I'm lending that I've lent out all my cards, so like I don't have Dwell, I don't have 101, I just don't have any of my rank, good ranks. So here goes. But you didn't really use your extra deck much at all, did you? Cowboy, no. Chain, chain's good because if you make a, you can send white prints, black shit, Zen mains, Castell. Diamond Dyer, Dullaham, Key Beetle, Utopia, Levia, and Tuzbeka. And so basically he would run 101 and Dwala uh, if he had them with him. But I'm lending them up this weekend to mates yeah. at Regional. So yeah, uh, this has been the deck profile. I hope you've enjoyed it. Um, give the deck a go. It's a cheap deck to run. It's a bit of fun. Um, you can pull off some pretty funky combos, get your King of School Servants on some pretty beefy attacks, 6, 7k, and go for game. Um, if you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Um, I will be bringing more of these sort of deck profiles as we will be running these tournaments once every couple of months. Uh, peace.